Today I'm going to teach you how to measure the length of different objects. Your grown-up might normally use a ruler or a measuring tape, but we're going to use non-standard units of measure. This could be marker pens, could be marbles, crayons, handspans or feet. Let's measure Harlan. I'm going to use marker pens. The marker pens must be the same length. I put the marker pens in a straight line. I make sure the marker pens start from the top of Paolo's head and go right to the end of his feet. I also make sure that there's no gap between the marker pens. How long is Paolo's head? That's right, he's one, two marker pens long. Well done. I'm now going to measure, measure this piece of paper. And I'm going to use my hand span. My hand span goes from my thumb all the way to my little finger and my fingers are spread out wide. I'm going to put my hand down on one piece and I'm going to put my hand down from where it goes. My hand goes from the top of the piece of paper to the bottom. They're in a straight line and I have left no gaps between each hand. How long is this piece of paper? That's right, it's two handspans long. Let's measure one more thing. I'm going to measure this crayon. And I'm going to, and my measuring tool is the marble. I'm going to put the marbles in a straight line. I put some blue tack at the end of the marbles because they're spheres and they might roll. So I put the marbles in a straight line. They're all the same size and I'm making sure that there is no gaps between the marbles. Can you see that the crayon is one, two, three, nearly four marbles long there is a little bit of crane at the end so we can say it's about four marbles long it's not exactly four marbles long well done everyone that's good measuring today let's go and find out what your challenge is 